Hey guys, in this video, I'm going to show you how to make a temperature control switch which will switch on and off this cooling fan for my 50 watt LED. Do stay tuned to my channel because I will make one of these one of these 50 watt portable LED flashlight in my future videos <laughs> so when this flashlight is in oper operation I don't want the fan to turn on all the time I only want the fan to turn on when the temperature of this heat sink gets hot so this circuit over here is basically an op amp wire up to become a Schmidt trigger. What a Schmidt trigger is, is that unlike a comparator, which only have one threshold, Schmidt trigger has two threshold. An upper threshold and a lower threshold. This circuit is designed such that if the lower threshold is reached at the inverting input of the op amp, the fan will turn on. Says the voltage at the inverting input goes down. Below the lower threshold, the fan turns on. After which, as the heat sink cools, the voltage at the inverting input will increase because the resistance on the thermistor will increase. Once the voltage and the inverting input hits the upper threshold, the fan turns off. When the flashlight is in operation, this cycle repeats itself. If I want to use a comparator, circuit, the fan turns on and off repeatedly. And the temperature of the heat sink is will be more or less fixed all the time for as long as the flashlight is in operation. So what sets the upper and lower threshold values is these three resistors over here. That 10k resistor, this resistor, and these two feedback resistors, which consists of a variable trim port and a fixed resistor. By adjusting this 22k trim port, you will adjust the gap between the lower and upper threshold voltage. And by adjusting this 2.2K trim port resistor, you will adjust the temperature at which the fan will trigger on. So let's see the operation of the circuit right now. As you can see, I turn on the power supply for the 50 watt LED lamp, turn on the power supply. For my Schmidt trigger circuit over here, I need to turn on the voltmeter over here to monitor the voltage.
and also the temperature of the circuit. <laughs> I mean the temperature of the heat sink. So right now as you can see the voltage at the inverting input is dropping because the temperature of the heat sink increases and therefore the resistance of the thermistor decreases and so is the voltage. Now let's see where is the lower threshold. We wait for a while. And as you can see, the fan is triggered on. And you can see that the voltage at which it is triggered is around 4.26 volts, somewhere there. Now let's wait for the upper threshold to be hit, to be reached. And here you go, the upper threshold is reached and therefore the fan turns back off. So now let's turn off the circuit. So guys, this is the schematic for my Schmidt trigger temperature control, control circuit. We may pause the video to get a snapshot of my schematic over here. And this is the record of my experiment with different values of resistor R1 and RF which is denoted over here and there respectively. Well, I hope you enjoyed the video. If yes, do comment, like and subscribe. And I will see you next time. Goodbye.